I'm standing in Plycar outside of the Iberostars, Stars, Quetzal and Toucan. When you stay in one, you have visiting privileges with the other. So it just means double the fun, double the restaurants. It doesn't matter which side you stay on, you get to enjoy the entire resort. Good morning, everyone. It's a beautiful day in paradise. I'm spending a few hours at the Ibero Star in Playa del Carmen. I'm in the Toucan lobby. I'm going to be meeting with the wedding planner. So follow along and let's see what this resort is all about. First impressions, this resort is beautiful. It's very tranquil. It is very authentic. Palapa thatched roof. Open air concept. Beautiful and clearly family oriented. Water features all throughout, a very tranquil feeling. At the Quetzal, I'm going to be meeting with the wedding planner. This is a authentic Mexican resort with the Palapa thatched roofs. So if you're wanting to experience something that's a bit more authentic, keep this resort on your radar. So follow along and let's see what we see. I'm super impressed. This is a beautiful lobby. Often I'm asked, I'd like to experience something a bit more authentic, Mexican style. Well, this is truly it. This resort is a combination of two lobbies, Quetzal and Toucan, with 700 rooms in total. Perfect for a multi-generational getaway and great for weddings. There will always be something to do with a resort this size. So follow along. This is the lobby bar. Who wouldn't want to sit here and enjoy a nice cold beer? Maybe a martini. Maybe a mojito. Open air. Really beautiful. Good morning. And your name is Emilio. Nice to meet you, Emilio. This is a stage for entertainment during the evening. So you can sit here, enjoy the surroundings. Have a 7-Up, have a beer, whatever your choice. There is lots of seating here in the lobby so you can come and relax. Wait for your transfer to go back home perhaps, sad day. Play some cards, read a book. Good morning everyone, this is Alejandra, she's in the wedding department. Yes. And so she will be your first point of contact and she's going to show us around this map so that we have an idea of what we're looking at. Yes, uh, this is a map for Iberostar Tucan and Quetzal. As you can see, uh, both us are uh, as a mirror. We have the same number of rooms uh, on both sides and uh, with the same, uh, both share uh, common areas as a pool, beach area, restaurants and theater. Right now we are here at the lobby, at Quetzal lobby. And uh, here you have the main, uh, the most of the uh, food and beverage services, so restaurants, main buffet, and bars. And uh, here you have the pool area, two restaurants, and the beach area. For weddings, we have the jungle here. Oh, I'm very anxious to see that. Yeah, the jungle venue is here. Uh, at the Quetzal area we have the Ocean View Garden. We have two areas at the beach for uh, one area at the Tucan Beach for ceremony and the main area for the, at the beach for uh, reception. And here is a Terraza Usmal, it's a restaurant open for um, lunch and it's a a la carte restaurant. 
at night, but the terrace uh, is the ocean view terrace for wedding. Oh, I bet it's wonderful. I'm anxious to see it. Okay. So, and this is Perfect. Thank you. And here we are. I get to spend a few hours with this lovely lady. Follow along. This is the gondola, an Italian food option, and it is all enclosed, so air conditioned. Beautiful walkways. I am very impressed. Isn't this beautiful? It's a waterfall. Just outside the lobby. Isn't this pretty? You can sit and have something to eat and listen to the water cascading. Look at the beautiful flamingos. This is the buffet if you want to have some breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And it is open air, meaning no air conditioning, but look at the magnificent view. Having a cup of coffee, having an omelet, and listening to the waterfall. This is a theater and they do have nightly entertainment so you can come and sit and watch the entertainment which is absolutely fabulous in Mexico I have to say. There's some pool tables, a bar. This is a place where you can have fun from like 8 o'clock until wherever. We are looking at the jungle area for weddings and my goodness you feel like you are right in the middle of a jungle. Isn't this beautiful? It will accommodate 80 people for your ceremony. So if you're wanting something that feels very authentic, very Mexican style, and there would be shade. The trees have a canopy so you're not going to be so very hot. When you're reviewing your wedding planning options, you can choose something called boho chic as a wedding package. And this would be where the reception and ceremony could be located. Everywhere I look there's pathways leading to yet more water features. Well what can I say? I'm in love with this resort. What a gorgeous place to have a, a wedding listening to the waterfalls in the background. And can you imagine your wedding pictures? Oh my goodness! Yet another waterfall. The activity pool. This is Hacienda, a Mexican restaurant, open air, and you get to enjoy a view of the pool as well. This is a pool that is shared by both lobbies, so Toucan and Quetzal, but it is a massive pool. I'm sure you could swim and not be near anybody. This is wonderful. Lots of birds chirping. And very pretty. And lots of chaise lounges and palapas for cover. And mature trees. So you can be in the sun or choose not to. This resort incorporates earthy tones. Terracotta, gold with touches of blue. It's very pretty. This is an area for weddings called Ocean View Garden. And is it ever true to its name? Oh my goodness. What a backdrop for your photos. If that's important, 
This may be a resort that should be on your radar. Look at how blue that ocean is. If you are wanting a room with a view, be sure to choose in the category Ocean Front. And this is what you would be waking up to. Just a little touch of heaven. And my goodness, are people ever enjoying swimming today. You can rent catamarans, wave runners. Yes. So that's lots of fun. This resort has kayaks, paddle boards, all for your use, but anything with a motor is at a cost. Are you impressed yet? I certainly am. Notice, no sargasm. Clear as a bell. This is an area for wedding receptions. So they clear away all the chairs and set up your tables and chairs for your function. This is the Ocean View Terrace for wedding receptions. Hola! We are viewing room 1022, an oceanfront room. This is beautiful. You can request one king bed or two doubles, and these are true double sized. These sofas are not pull out, but they would accommodate a small child, seven, eight years old. And in the morning, you would step out to this magnificent view and sip your coffee in the morning, have a glass of wine at night, relax, diffuse, and be totally confident you've chosen this resort for your all-inclusive getaway. And I am now seated on a chair and you do have a very clear view, so the wall is not too high. These rooms have been newly renovated. So USB port for your phone, plugins for your devices, which is always important, large flat screen TV, and this is the mini bar stocked every day. Basic, but nonetheless, you can get a beer or a Coke. At our Bureau Star, they do not work with plastic, so they give you these refillable bottles to take with you. I think that is fabulous to be so environmentally conscious. three pillows on the bed, lights beside the bed, and again, plug-ins for your devices, cool tones of blue, overhead fan, closet with a safe, iron and ironing board, and enough hangers. This is a bathroom with one sink. Some amenities, a makeup mirror, hair dryer, toilet, and a large shower with a waterfall shower head. All rooms are air conditioned, so you will be very comfortable here. And this is an ocean front room. We are now going to be looking at room 1110, a superior room, lead-in room category. This is a superior room with a view of the pool. All the rooms look the same inside, so don't ever fear that you're going to be getting a, a lesser room. It's just the view that changes. 
So again, beautiful blue tones. One sofa in this room instead of two. And this is your view from the balcony. Lots of beautiful trees and foliage and you can see the pool. And every room has the glass bottles, no plastic. Same fabulous plugins for all of your devices. And mini bar stocked with Coke, Sprite, and a couple of beer. The bathroom with a large shower waterfall shower head, single sink, amenities, hair dryer, and makeup mirror. Superior room with a view of the pool. This is the beach area for wedding ceremonies. Accommodate up to a hundred people and look at the view. Absolutely spectacular. So your Wedding Palapa, your arch would be at the end there by those two trees and people would be seated all along here. How gorgeous. We're viewing the ocean front rooms. If you wanted to play some ping pong, you just go to the entertainment area and ask for paddles and balls. And it's completely covered with a canopy of trees. And if you have small kids, this is an area for them to play. Pool, swings, all supervised by professionals. The kids club is for children aged four to 12. This is an herb garden and the chefs can come down here and pick fresh herbs for cooking. And also it's a little bit of an activity for children to walk through and learn about gardening. We are now on the Toucan side, and again, this lovely pathways through the garden. And if you were having a wedding in a garden area, there's a canopy of trees that will keep you cool. This resort is two lobbies that are shared. They share the pools and they do share the wedding location. So if you're staying at Quetzal, you can have your wedding at Toucan in the jungle setting. This is the buffet at Quetzal, but you can have something to eat at Toucan. All the amenities, all of the restaurants are shared. We are now viewing room 1701 on the Quetzal side, and this is a basic standard room. All rooms do look the same from the inside. It's just the view that changes. This has a view of the gardens. It's lovely and cool in here hot outside so it feels really good to be in some air conditioning. And a bathroom with a standard shower head. Single sink. Blow dryer and makeup mirror. You would be comfortable here. This is a restaurant called Mare Nostrum. It is Mediterranean and it is enclosed so you can dine in air conditioning.
great area for seating. So if you want to come here and read a book, play cards, just sit and relax. It's lovely. There's the reception desk for check-in. This is Bonsai, a Japanese restaurant now. It's not open, so the chairs are up, but you do have an option of dining here. This is the lobby bar of the Quetzal. They do have overhead fans. And I've just enjoyed a beer because it is very hot here. Area for some nightly entertainment. One thing I've noticed is this resort is very organized and very clean. They have different flavors of water with rosemary or lemons and limes. This resort does not use plastic, so you can purchase some containers here if you want to carry around some water, but I think it's fabulous when a resort is very eco-friendly and conscientious. We're viewing the alcohol choices. So I'm sure you will find something that you like if you like Captain Morgan's, which I do. Sky Vodka. Some tequilas. Beef Eater. Wild Turkey. Ballantines. Jim Beam. Canadian Club, or as we Canadians call it, CC. Glenfiddich. I'm sure you would find something to drink that you would truly enjoy and if alcohol is not what you require they do have a cappuccino machine lots of wine and different kinds of beer as well the alcohol on this top shelf does come with an added cost because it is premium so there's Martel Glenfiddich and you can pay just for a single shot and the bartender here is going to tell us about some beer Include the beer of the Dos Equis and Dos Equis Samba. This is the beer camp is extra charge. You pay extra for the water. All this is the all the extra also is the charge of the room. Okay. Uh, the beer can also have the bring from Japanese. But on tap, that is the house beer. Yeah. No charge. Okay. And your name is? My name is Shamani. Nice to meet you. There is a lobby shopping area, so if you want to get some chips, something cold to drink, something to take home for the family, a t-shirt, maybe a hat, this is the place to come. When you check into the Ibero Star, there is a desk. I can see Sunwing experiences there. You'll come and ask any questions that you need, chat about what time to be in the lobby for your pick up transfer, they talk about excursions, so be sure to look for a desk somewhere near the lobby for any of those details. And you can go from lobby to lobby in a golf cart. It's not very far, but you can take a cart. This resort is so lush, so clean and well manicured. I'm just now leaving the Ibero Star out the front gates and this is an area, a residential area, very easy to walk around. I feel completely safe here. There's lots of homes and apartments, beautiful walkway. There's a shopping mall just down the way. So if you like to go outside the resort and explore, you may wish to choose a resort that's located in Playa del Carmen, in Playa Car. Hey everyone, it's Susan at Escapes. I'm going to give you my personal opinion on my feelings about the Ibero Star in Playa Car, Quetzal and Toucan, two lobbies side by side. I am impressed. I love this resort. It would be great for two people getting away that want to experience something very unique. It would be great for families um, of all ages, little kids all the way up, and superb for weddings. There are so many 
locations that are so unique. Where can you get married in the jungle? I mean, it's just spectacular. And the backdrop of the turquoise ocean, it is really amazing. The other thing I like as a travel agent is they're very quick to respond to emails. The wedding planners are on point. They know what they're doing and they're so kind. So I think that if you're planning a destination wedding, a getaway for two, or a family vacation, you need to think about this resort, Iberostar.